Hello party people. I'm at Costco right now. I actually just got done shopping. I wasn't sure if I was going to do a shop with me or just a haul. Turns out I'm going to do both in one video. Say what? I wasn't expecting to find so many awesome things inside to show you. So anyway, let's go shopping and then I'll show you the haul. Great reminder for all of us to change our filters. You get three in here for $20. I don't know about that. My husband and I, we ordered ours off Amazon a few years ago. We got like 50 for $30, I wanna say. It was a crazy screaming deal. Ooh, a good accent rug. You know what? I feel like I need a new welcome rug. This is for inside the house though, but $15 for that. Oh my Lord, $14 for this runner. <gasps> I do need a new runner. This one looks really pretty. Uh-oh, I didn't come here for this. Oh, look at this print too. Oh Lord. Ooh, hold on, there's more down here. And this one. Ooh, this one. Okay, I had to think hard on that. This shredder is holy $88. Is that really necessary? I feel like you could buy these for like 20 bucks at Target. There must be something amazing about this. Oh, it has like a micro cut, okay. Oh, no, 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 this is what's amazing. It can shred CDs and credit cards, okay. Well, I guess that's worth the extra money. I don't know, I just burn all my crap. That nice plastic smell is always refreshing. Okay, here are some fillers for your toothbrush, $40. The air fryer, are people still loving this thing or is everyone on the Instapot train? And here it is. I mentioned this a while ago, $20 for all of these. You don't know how much of a screaming deal that is. I have a feeling these are gonna go very quickly. A partay basket. Okay, tell me more. It would include, oh, are you kidding me? Okay, this thing is 20 bucks. It includes the Tupperware and the basket. And it's insulated. Oh, I need to walk away. That print is really cute. $20, guys. Okay, I don't know what kind of rabbit hole I just fell down, but these are currently on sale. They're leggings. It's a two pack for $12. Velvety soft, I can attest to that. They feel fantastic. Also some underwear. Where was it? Over here. Guys, $5 for a six pack. Mm -mm. You can't find that deal at Victoria's Secret. Just saying. There's a three pack of camisoles. They're currently on sale for $10, normally 13. Um, I have a pack of these, love them, but I have these colors. Fantastic, it comes with a hint of modal. I don't know what that is. Maybe it has something to do with this weird color on her back. Just kidding, it's a type of material. Okay, I'm gonna need to know that when I go to Milan and start my fashion career. Another screaming deal for you at Costco, kids stretchy pants, $7. Uh, say what? Oh my gosh, they even have ones with stars. <gasps> I feel like my daughter would love these. Those are all bigger kid sizes though. Maybe they ran out of the little sizes. I'm currently kicking myself. I just saw this crock pot at Salvation Army yesterday. I'll link that vlog below, but oh my gosh, it was $8. And I didn't test it. I was like, oh, don't worry about because I already tested one and it didn't work. It left a sour taste in my mouth. Now I have FOMO. This one's almost 30. Oh, let's keep walking. A, it's the most wonderful time. Guys, beach towels. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Not just any beach towel. It is a resort towel. Oh my goodness, $10. Oh wait, $10 for that one. $10.99 for that one. The dollar difference, I have to know. Ooh, it's worth the dollar difference. Is it though? Or am I just influenced? Something I have never seen before, these ombre throw blankets for $12. Um, it is blowing my mind. I can't really tell the ombre as much on this one. Oh my gosh, but gorgeous for $12 for a blank. Are you kidding? They sell toilets, this, that's just weird. We know it's weird. We know they sell like the spaceship toilet we saw during Christmas. But I wanted to ask you guys about the countertops. Is that a trend? The like no feet on the bottom. I almost bought one and then I realized that it was one, you know, that kind and I thought, I think I need more storage. What do you guys think? Love it, hate it? Let me know. Okay, two things that are pretty necessary in Florida weather, wetsuit seat covers, amazing. Here's the front of the box. 
This is $25 for two. I feel like that's a great deal. And they are stain resistant. And this solar shade, this is definitely necessary in Florida. This is $10. Apparently it's a three piece sunshade set. Ooh, say that three times fast. Sunshade set, sunshade set, sunshade set. Nailed it. It reflects heat and glare, form fitting, stay close. Why, why are there three pieces though? Is that necessary? Maybe it's like different sizes to fit different size cars. Okay, I don't care, I'm over it. Where are my hangers? I'm literally freaking out right now. Look what I found, can't believe it. $10 for 50 non-slip hangers. <laughs> okay, oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, how many boxes should I buy? How many are left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Should I buy all of them? Oh my gosh, this is awesome. If you've been here a while, you guys know that Eleanor is obsessed with this Dubliner cheese, but hold on to your boots. They have another kind. What? First time I've ever seen it. Same price per pound, but I guess it is reserve cheddar. Ooh, should we try it out? Should we take the risk? I don't know. I don't know. They have these out for a sample and I almost forgot how delicious they are. Oh my gosh, $11.99 for... How many do you get? I don't know, do you see it on there? That's how many, 40 ounces. I've never really shared like the pre-packaged meal portion of Costco with you. Here's a new one, it's $5.59 a pound and it is street tacos. So you get like chicken, some, I don't know, what is that, lettuce blend. Ooh, some limes in there, salsa, I mean, you, you can see. They also have chicken noodle soup. That's fantastic. I bought it once when we were all sick with the flu last year. Luckily, we've all been able to escape it this year. Have you guys been as lucky as we have? Uh, have you guys been as lucky as we have? Meatloaf and mashed potatoes. This is great for when you're just in a rush those days. You know, when you have busy days, you don't have time to make dinner. I just think it's fantastic. I've seen a lot of people try this quinoa salad. I have yet to try it. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, a tortellini pasta salad. Oh, Costco is testing me. A bunch of shrimp. They're only $12. That's a pretty good price. Oh, and the salad. Oh my gosh, delicious. Yep, same with that chicken salad. Oh, so good. Then they always have these pizzas to take and bake. They're enormous, the size of your oven. The sample lady is really trying to push this hummus every two seconds. She's like, hummus? Hum Guys, it got me. Per the usual, samples at Costco got me. This cilantro lemon hummus, oh, you guys, it's worth wasting these two, I think, even if you don't like hummus, just for this, it is delicious. $6.39, you would pay that for a small little container of hummus at another grocery store. I'm having a hard time here. I know one of you have tried these. Let me know if you have strawberries. Oh, with sugar, huh, that makes me second guess it. Why add sugar? Is it frozen is what I'm trying to understand. 16 fruit cups for $10. All right, let's figure this out. Half a cup of serving of fruit. I mean, I would assume. Okay, so here it is. Total sugar, 21 grams. Added sugar is 10. Is that necessary? I don't know why I'm all like, ooh, added sugar is bad. And then look at these cake truffles. Want them. Key lime bites, yes please tiramisu in my cart but for real these key lime pie bites i'm pretty sure they are new or seasonal not sure they are 9.79 Ooh, 30 delicious frozen key lime pie bites i'm sure there's plenty of added sugar in that why do i care that it's in there i don't know i don't know guys i don't have all the answers okay i don't know what's going on in this brain of mine yay it's the year of the pig i'm a rabbit what are you what does that plant represent money tree i think i need that I mean, you have to pay $25 to get it. So how much will it give you? Is it a good investment is all I'm asking. <laughs> I don't mean to be inappropriate, but did you guys know they sold these here in bulk? $12.50 for a 40 pack? I don't know how what they usually go for, but I'm assuming that's a steal. Okay, I need new glasses. What do we think? One, two, these might be a little large for my face. Or three, I really like that these are clear. I don't know, I kind of really like these. Are they too small for my face? It's so hard picking out a pair of glasses. Ooh, square ones. These would be a change for me for sure. Guys, I've been wearing glasses since I was like 18 months old. <laughs> kind of like the square. What do you guys think? Let me know below. 
I never know what looks good on my face shape. And then I always end up picking like the worst option. Okay, last ones. I don't know. I lied. There's so many options. Okay, let's go. We are home now. Well, I'm home now. <laughs> I will show you everything that I got from Costco. I spent more money than I thought I would, but that pretty much happens every time I go to Costco. So let me show you everything I got. All right, here it is as a whole. Let's start by the produce. Got a couple of things of strawberries, a little expensive. Uh, cucumbers, oh you guys, I haven't had a salad in a couple of days because I've been out of cucumbers. Can't have a salad without cucumbers. I mean, you could, but whatever. Brussels sprouts right there. These are little baby Brussels sprouts. Look how cute they are. Um, I probably wasted my money on this watermelon. I know it's not quite in season, but I am craving it because here in Florida, the weather's so nice, we have our windows open. I have oranges here. And can I tell you, I only recently discovered the difference between clementines and mandarins. I think clementines have seeds. Is that right? Or they're both technically mandarins. I don't know. It's really confusing. One has seeds, one doesn't. Mandarins, whatever I picked up here, the halos, they're good to go. I also grabbed these. This is not produce, but these are crepes. My family eats these like they're going out of style. I personally don't think they're that delicious. They're just crepes filled with hazelnut chocolate, hazel, chocolate hazelnut filling whatever it's like Nutella basically but the cheaper version I grabbed this thing of fresh broccoli I should have grabbed a frozen bag of broccoli but sometimes I just want to eat raw broccoli you know what I mean I also grabbed some blueberries some raspberries Wentworth is so cute and he puts the raspberries on his fingers adorable and then I grabbed some potatoes I really love roasting these I just cut them in half coat them with like a little bit of olive oil salt and pepper and throw them in the oven or I have made mashed potatoes with these. Oh my gosh, just as delicious if you don't mind the skin, which I eat the skin anyway, so good. I also grabbed a bundle, bunch, hand, whatever, bananas. Oh, you guys, I know you're wondering, what kind of cheese did I buy? I figured, might as well try a new kind. I'll let you guys know what we think of it, slash Eleanor, because Eleanor is mostly the one who eats it, and I could not resist. Oh! <laughs> summer is coming I am craving summer guys lemon bites are you kidding me look how cute these are do you notice there's one missing yes I ate it on the way home it was everything I dreamed it would be so delicious but now we have this many luckily we are having uh, my family meets once a month for family dinner and I, I will definitely bring those because otherwise I will eat them all and have a little bit of regret but mostly no regret because most of the time I eat good well I don't know. It's like 50-50 these days. <laughs> no, most of the time I eat pretty well. Okay, I also got these. Okay, this was a mistake. I got two of these. They were just shoved randomly in a section, and I thought they were like nine something, like 10 bucks. So I thought, okay, I'll get two because we're having family dinner, and we usually do a theme. This, this month's theme will be uh, Chinese New Year because the Chinese New Year is coming up. And so I grabbed these because these are kind of like China. I don't know. I thought they would be good. Stick with the theme. Uh, beef steak appetizers. Okay, when I was checking out, like everyone was asking if they were good. And I was like, I don't know, I haven't had them yet. And then when I was leaving, the person who checks my receipt, she asked me the same. I was like, oh my gosh, I don't know. So these were almost $18, $18. Can you believe it? $40. On meat oh my gosh guys this is why I eat tofu meat is so expensive I will be eating it before I post this video so I will let you know right here whether or not it's worth it or what my family thought of it anyway because I'm not sure even sure if I'll, maybe I'll eat one piece oh and it's barbecue if that makes a difference okay I also got some eggs my poor chick I really miss my chickens and then this hummus I told you guys about it in the shop with me I guess I could just make the lemon cilantro hummus myself I used to make hummus from scratch all the time but I just don't anymore, okay? It just, I can't, I won't find the time for it. I also got these Z-Bars. These were on sale, great price for 36 bars. At Target, you get a box of like six bars for, I don't know, five, six dollars. And then, <laughs> the best part of the haul, I got some hangers, one hundo hangers. I don't think my husband will be using these. That means I have a hundred hangers to fill up, people. I also got some feta cheese. I love to shake this on my salad. My sister told me it's good on eggs. You guys ever put feta cheese on eggs? I haven't yet. I think I will in the future. Oh my gosh, and every time I go to Costco, these scream at me, they stare at me, 
They say, Kim, buy me, take me home. It's a two pack for less than $8. I was weak today and I bought them. No regrets, I bet they're gonna be delicious. I also got a bunch of chicken noodle soup, some bread, my family loves this bread. We go through it like crazy. And then we ran out of barbecue sauce the other night, so I grabbed a pack of barbecue sauce. These are the large bottles too. And these, this is like $5 for both of them. Say what? I needed some gloves for my work, so I grabbed some. I needed a small, size small, but they didn't have any. Why'd they do that to me? Look, my fingers. Well, I guess they kinda look okay. All right, maybe I got the right size, I don't know. Good enough is what I say. And then I got some Cheez-Its. I don't really know why. Salty foods got me. That is everything that I got in my haul. I hope you enjoyed shopping with me slash seeing a haul slash let me know if you guys like to see them together. Sometimes I separate them because the shop with me's are just extraordinarily long. But thanks for hanging out. Subscribe if you enjoyed your time with me and you'd like to put a little more happy in your day next time. I'll see you tomorrow or Monday or whenever you're watching this. Monday to Friday, bye!